This game is rated M and is intended for mature audiences. Hey there, buddy! Any new tips for surviving Rena? Or are we not getting any new tips? We're not even getting new tips today! Aww, I wanted new tips. I was out of it and couldn't bring myself to do anything until dinner except stare blankly into space. <laughs> we probably look like Rena! <laughs> was I terrified from Rena going off on me? No, that's not right. That was somebody else who only looked like Rena. Then, who could it have been? It was her identical twin, Blenna. <laughs> She's the worst. It was a dreadful feeling. Knowing that it, that was someone else, not Rena. So tomorrow, I shouldn't have a problem talking to Rena like I usually do. That thought was strangely comforting. I concluded that I should just calm down and clear my head. Though those thoughts continued swirling around my mind. Finally, I returned to my senses as I heard my mother calling out for me from the bottom of the stairs. Oh, yay! Barnes & Noble called. Bookstore? Can't think of why they'd be calling me. I went downstairs and picked up the receiver anyway. Oh, Usi! <laughs> you own a bookstore? <laughs> Dude, that was just my cover. <laughs> <laughs> He's actually not a cop, guys. He's just a, an eccentric bookshop owner. The fact that he's not even telling that you're our parents is pretty sus. <laughs> I guess that's true. This is the police. I'd like to speak to your teenage son. That, that would probably freak me out if I was a parent. Uisi-san was, in his own way, rather courteous. Even so, I didn't want my parents hearing me talk to the police. I brought the cordless phone with me as I dashed back up to my room on the second floor. どうぞ。he gave me the number for his direct line as I wrote it down. I thought that was the end of it, but he began making pointless small talk, and it was pretty hard to hang up. I hate it when people do that! <laughs> well, my best friend, I, who lives across the street, I learned is psycho today. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> Did you funny you should mention that! I see. This was the real reason. He really beat around the bush there. His adult conversational skills left me slack-jawed. If he's from around here, he might know. Whereas my friends would say they didn't know when I asked, this older man gave me a direct answer. It made me a bit happy that he answered me directly without trying to hide anything. Keiji, you've been on the phone at the bookstore owner for a long time. Sorry, we're arguing about pricing for the new Garfield treasury. <laughs> Again, funny you should mention that. Naturally, everyone decided to move there. Well, technically, Keiichi, nobody is in hell yet. Demon snatching up people is what this Onikakushi really means. I already knew about the mysterious deaths happening five years in a row, but I didn't know that there were people disappearing for those same five years. 
たたりと鬼隠しが必ず一緒にそれは初めて聞きましたそうなんですか前原さんそれは俺が聞きたいですよレナとミオンが話してたんですお社様のたたりなら必ずたたりと鬼隠しが起こるって「おいしさん」began hemming and hawing on the other end of the receiver Maybe something about that came to mind. Maibara san. Saisho no jiken, gozonji desu yo ne. Oh, yeah. Barabara satsuji. Eh. Rokunin no hanin no uchi, hitori wa mada tosou chu nan desu yo ne. Tatoe ba sore, tosou chu janaku, oni kakushi ni attan janai desu yo ka ne. Huh? It was an outrageous hypothesis from Uisi san. The incident four years ago was a particularly ghastly one. The police already knew the perpetrators, so they posted tons of wanted posters with his face on them. They staked out various locations and investigated every possible escape route he had. But, after four years, there wasn't even a hint of where he might be. Unless the police were completely incompetent. Even if it was an outrageous hypothesis, I couldn't simply laugh it off. <laughs> Hmm. At the time of the incident, with the river below the cliff being muddy rapids, the police divers had searched every branch off the main stream of the river for dozens of miles. But in the end, they weren't able to find her body. I'm not sure if it was right to call that being demoned away. The wife is missing. At least that part was reality. The wife had supposedly thrown herself into the bottomless swamp deep in the forest around Hinamizawa, meaning it's all circumstantial evidence. They simply found her suicide note in front of the swamp. A diver was able to recover a few of her articles, but they weren't able to find a body. The investigative headquarters believed that she had faked her death and was still alive somewhere. これらを鬼隠しと呼んでいいかちょっとわかりませんがね。前原さんの言う通り確かに毎年一人行方不明になっています。今年の事件では富田さんの連れの女の人が行方不明。じゃあ去年の主婦の撲殺事件はどうです？
何か共通点があるとか。Uisi-san mumbled as he seemed to be thinking about it. So I summarized the events. 1年目はダムの作業員。2年目は誘致派の男の妻。3年目は神主の妻。4年目は被害者宅の子供で5年目は交際相手かな特につながりはなさそうだし1年目はともかく妻とか交際相手とかそういう人が目立ちますな It does seem like there are a lot Then that means the fourth year's victims The fourth year's victims child was different It would have really stood out if they were all married couples, except it's not just married couples, but parents and children as well. Come to think of it, I believe Tomotake san also told me the younger brother is alive and has moved, if I recall correctly. I remember that name. Didn't they tell me Satoshi had transferred out last year? Come to think of it, when I transferred in, I believe they said my seat belonged to a recent transfer student. Then, where I sat. Once belonged to the one who was demoned away. It was his seat? I recalled the cold sensation that came from that desk. It made my hair stand on end. This strain of mysterious deaths. No. Oyashiro sama's curse. I now knew how it connected to me. That chilling sensation. It was the feeling of Oyashiro sama caressing the back of my neck. Oyashiro sama no tadari. I think you're being paranoid here, buddy. Could Oyashiro sama's curse. Really exist? No, no. In all honesty, I was beginning to believe it. And I was scared. That was why I wanted to say it was a plot crafted by man and not the work of a curse. But the more I dug into it, the less likely that seemed. No, the more I dug, the more mysterious it became. If I kept digging, eventually, I'd reach the point where I'd learn something I really shouldn't know. To either be none the wiser or to seek an answer I may regret. Which one would I be happier with? You'd probably be happier to keep stay in ignorance, but it would be better for you if you knew the truth. Maybe it'll be me next time. My execution could only be delayed but for one year. That was when I remembered. Rena. Rena said that she may be the next victim of the curse. Ryugu Rena san ga desu ka? Kyonan tenkou sarete kita. Why is it every time I talk with this guy, Keiichi ends up getting more scared and paranoid? Like, I feel like this is not a good thing. <laughs> How delightfully sexist of you. I get it, though, but I think that Rena might be tougher than we're giving her credit for. It wasn't that. She said it might be her next. She said it in a way that made me think that she had a concrete reason behind it. She was frightened. Her sudden change in demeanor. That someone who looked like Rena but wasn't Rena. That might be unrelated. All the strange things that I felt from Rena today came back to me. So, this I don't like spying on her. At that moment, just as my mouth was agape because I was so impressed with his mature, clever way with his words. Knock, knock! A sudden knock up the door set my heart racing. In an instant, I had pointlessly covered up the end of the receiver. I'm still talking to the bookstore owner! <laughs> They don't have all the Garfield treasuries I want. On the other side of the door, I heard my father's oddly upbeat voice. What could it be? It's so late! <laughs> Nani ka wakarimashita ra, oshiete kudasai. 
こちらも進展がありましたらご報告では失礼しますケイチ早く開けてくれ<笑>父さん両手が塞がってるんだ Who calls themself daddy when talking to their teenage son? Nobody, that's who. What is dad doing? I had stayed in the same position while on the phone the whole time, so my joints were aching. When I opened the door, I saw my father was standing there with a tray. On that tray, cookies and two cups of black tea. A fairly fancy spread for our household. There was even sugar and lemon slices on the side. Everything you could ask for. This was quite the show of hospitality. What? 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 それ、何のつもりだよもう、はぐらかすなよ、ケイチ。入るぞ。Okay, bro, why is ケイチ's dad acting so weird? <laughs> dad was in high spirits and had a smirk on his face. He must, he must have gotten his like, next amazing painting and he's going to sell it for like big book book book! <laughs> But for my entire life, I have never seen him act this hospitable. What had gotten into him? Did? 何の話をしてたんだ You know,、uh, just、um, Garfield treasuries. I jumped. It's not something I had to keep for my father. But how could I explain to him that I was talking to a detective? I'm assuming he was this late at night. Be, 別に何も友達だよ。電話の話じゃなくて。Then what do you mean? してたんだろう、今。What? レナちゃんが。What? I had no idea what dad was talking about, but a cold sweat dripped down my back. Do you know what I'm talking about? レナちゃんが2階に上がったのが半くらいだったから、小1時間くらいかな。おぉ、フッジ、シーワズリスニングインアウトサイド。ドゥ、this is getting so creepy <笑>。2階に上がったのを、父さん見たのああ、見たよ。おぉ、レナズ giving me the chills。ケイチの部屋は、階段を上がって奥の扉だよって声もかけた。Then I came to my house about an hour ago. Dad met her at the door and called out to me on the second floor. I probably didn't hear him because I was so focused on my conversation with Uisi san. I didn't reply, but he knew I was in my room, so he had her come inside. Then told her my room was on the second floor. She thanked my dad and went upstairs. Then about an hour passed. She passed by my dad just as he was bringing up tea and left. She came upstairs and about an hour passed. Then passed by my dad and returned home. And then, after she came upstairs and until she left, where was Rena? Probably eavesdropping. There's only a short hallway between my room and the stairs. Meaning, Rena had, for about an hour, in the hall. No, she couldn't have been standing in front of my door all that time. The door to my room wasn't particularly thick. You could easily hear everything being said inside. All of the unsettling and unguarded things I spoke to Uisi san about began rustling through my head. Mom yelled up at Dad from downstairs. Dad left the tray with me and went downstairs with a disappointed chortle. I followed my dad out of the room with my eyes. And I looked down at the floor down around the hallway where Rena might have stood all that time. Just now, as I was talking to Uisi san, with my back turned, Rena was standing a mere six feet away the whole time. Ah! Oh, freaking hell, that was so creepy! <laughs> all that time, in this dimly lit doorway. What did she see? What did she hear? For what reason? I was not ready for that CG. What the heck? <laughs> well, shoot, that is creepy. <laughs> As the steam from two teacups ominously wafted and twisted, the aroma of the black tea filled my room. Holy crow! <laughs> This is getting so good. <laughs> Hmm. 
New tips unlocked. Notice from the police chief. Oh, <laughs> achievement unlocked. Lies! <laughs> That's a creepy image there, too. I think Rena may not be okay. I also think Keiichi may not be okay. Well. Notice from the police chief. Let's get our new tip. July 1st, 1982. To departments 1 through 12. Redacted Prefecture Police Headquarters. Director General Redacted. To the Chief Constable and all Facility Managers, regarding cases situated in the Hinamizawa Village, notice. As cases in Shishibone City, Hinamizawa Village has been reported by certain sections of mass media. It has drawn global attention, which is causing serious repercussions for the local residents. This has become a very serious situation. To protect the livelihood and the prosperity of the residents, the following notice has been issued. 1. Designate the following criminal investigations as classified. Okinomiya Station, 1982, case number redacted. Hinamizawa Village, housewife murder, dated June, redacted. Okinomiya Station, 1982, case number, redacted. Hinamizawa Village, student disappearance, dated June, redacted. 2. Non-disclosure information. Okinomiya Station, 1979, case number, redacted. Hinamizawa Village, site form and murder, dated June, redacted. Shira Station, 1980, case number, redacted. Shirakawa Natural Park Falling Incident, dated June, redacted. Okinomiya Station, 1981, case number, redacted. Hinamizawa Village Shinto Priest's Wife's Disappearance, dated June, redacted. 3. Requesting self-restraint from each organization concerning the release of sensitive information. Please see attached reference materials 1, 2, and 3. Management, redacted prefecture, uh, police headquarters. Internal line, redacted. Police Affairs Department, redacted, redacted. Well, okay then. Um, so for people who have experienced the story before, roughly how much do you think we have left of this chapter one? Because I am thinking of leaving it there for tonight and finishing up the rest on Halloween, if we think we can get it all done on Halloween. I'm also at this point pretty tempted to just take the day after Halloween off of work, so that way if I have to stay up until like 2am or 3am to finish it, I can. And man, that would be really creepy. <laughs> this is a good stopping point? I Yeah, I, I agree. Wowie. I was not expecting Rena to just go crazy like that. That's freaking amazing, though. <sighs> I don't... I don't know, though, because here's the thing. We're now, like... Ra I don't want to say we're racing through it, but the plot's happening at a much more fast-paced pace. Whereas the first two streams were kind of just like, haha, nothing really happened. We're just introducing the characters. Now it really feels like we're getting through the plot a lot. Uh, yeah, you can point something out, uh, Proxima, for sure. As long as it's not, like, a story spoiler. If it's something that I should already know, though, based on what's appeared and I just haven't made the connection yet, that's also fine. Dang, the music in this game is good. It sets the mood perfectly for the right scenes. Where have we heard the surname Hojo before? I don't remember. Sorry, I, there are a lot of names. I don't remember. But I'm guessing it's an important last name. He was like, oh no! You just had to type it. So Satoshi is related in some way to Satoko. I guess that makes that their first names are pretty similar, actually. <laughs> I I'm ready. I'm I'm ready for messed up. 
this is this is why I was playing it during October. I, I, I can if I can prepare myself in advance, I can take it. I'm a bi I'm a big kid now. Oh. So I wonder if Satoshi's disappearance has something to do with why Satoko is acting in such a weird way. It gets really violent. I can handle violence. As as long as Twitch is not like Can we finish this on Halloween? I hmm. I'm gonna have to check my total stream time of this game. I've played for 8.8 .8 hours. Hmm. But is the is that 8.8 .8 hours counting what I've played for this time? It probably is, cause I re I read on, like, how long does it take to beat.com or whatever it's called, that it takes roughly 12 hours to clear this, so... Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I gotta... Th I think at the very least I probably need to call it here for tonight, just because I do have work in the morning, and I... Have, I work relatively early. So. Yeah, I think we're going to end the stream there. I'll have to f I'll have to think about it if I want to stream on Sunday and, or if I just want to do a lone Monday stream. Because I remember Halloween last year, I streamed all of Doki Doki Literature Club and that was one of the longest streams I did. I started at 8 and I ended, ended at like 2 a.m. I'm okay with doing that again. I think what I'll do is we'll just finish it up on Halloween Maybe we'll start earlier on Halloween than we normally do. And I just stream until we're done. That's my current plan. I'll let you guys know if my plans change. But, wow, yes. This, this is what I was hoping for when I played this. And this is also a different kind of creepy. Like, a lot of the horror games are creepy just because it's like, Oh, look, blood, gore, bleh. But here, this is this is more of like a psychological horror, and I like that. That's that, that get in my opinion, that gets a lot creepier, and it gets it sticks with you more. So fantastic! Thanks for joining in, everybody. This is definitely a lot of fun. We had some <laughs> things are getting a little spooky now. I we might be streaming on Sunday. Otherwise, just anticipate on Halloween. We're going to be having a pretty large stream of this. I have to imagine so. Thank you all very much, and I hope you have a fantastic rest of your night, and God bless.